Hello again. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And this time Struck has something massive update out there. In this video, we'll be looking into the new updates. So Struck has recently launched Struck Studio. That is basically a PC version of the Struck, which means now we can finally create games on PC. However, it's in beta version and more updates might come in future updates. Uh, but I'm a lot more excited to try it out. You can find it out at struck.com under this section, and you can download for whatever platform you have that is Windows or Mac. Click to download and click on save, and the file will be downloaded. After download, you will see this installer. Now double click to install it. Just click on next and follow up to install it. So after installing open struck studio, uh, so it will check and download updates. Let's fast forward. it. Um, now log in with your account details and this will take you to the homepage on the top is your account profile. On left sidebar, you can find your games and templates section on main page. You have your already published games and drafts, but we will be creating a new blank project. So this is your uh, blank draft. You can look around by camera in different direction by holding right button to mouse and dragging left or right. To move camera up or down, click and hold your mouse wheel and drag forward or backward. You can move around by click and hold your mouse wheel and drag in left or right direction. There's a keyboard shortcut as well. Also, you can just zoom in or out by scrolling your mouse wheel. Let's now check out some basic tools. So. Let's first add a cube. Um, you can change object properties from here. Uh, so the first one is select tool for selection. Uh, the second one is move tool. This is used for moving in specific direction you want. The third is rotate. This is more accurate and easy than what is available on mobile devices. This one is scale tool. You can make changes in scale in particular direction. These are certainly more accurate tool that in mobile. Or you can just reset the object if you feel you messed up. You can also drag object to move freely. However, for accurate movement, use move tool to position your object. right side we have all those property available like for mobile devices like skin health and other stats you can change its property accordingly let's make a playable game by adding a character. To move camera, hold mouse button and drag forward or backward to do something like this. This will take few practice and will be easy to go. To select multiple objects, you can just simply select items using right mouse button. You can play around with move, scale or rotate tool as well. Right, this is similar to multi-select available in Struck Mobile. We can change player settings too. Let's uh, keep default for now. So it's time to test our game. 
Click on top center button to test your game. You can read instructions for game controls. To test in phone, select this icon near to publish. So I have connected my device and logged in with same account. So by this way, we can test in mobile device. On the left side, the plus icon shows asset library similar as on mobile. It also has terrain editor. Let's try this one. This is kind of cool in PC mode. Also, it has all other settings as well. Uh, we can change terrain for different themed games. Um, uh, these are some other general game settings like available on mobile devices. So it's amazing stuff struck has created. Um, everything is working fine, but still a few more improvement are needed. And so, yeah, overall amazing stuff to try out. You've got a decent working PC. Try this out. It's just awesome. So that's all for this video and I'll see you by next time.